Hello everyone. This is the Swiss Manager Tutorial. Part 12. Important Dialog Boxes. In this video I'm going to discuss, Cash Prize Dialog Box, Correction of Wrong Participants Data Using Update Player Dialog Box, and Print Dialog Box. First, let's talk about Cash Prize Dialog Box. The prize dialog is called with menu, other, money prizes. It is used for entering of the prizes and printing the prize list. The prizes can be entered at the beginning of the tournament. They are saved in the tournament file. If you open the dialog, the current round is displayed and the players according to the ranking list are shown. Note this. The player can be excluded by the input of minus one. For the prize calculation three methods are available. 1. Hort system, every player gets the first 50% of the prizes according to his rank. The other 50% are distributed uniformly within a score group over the players. 2. Split prizes, all players receive the same prize within a score group. 3. Do not split prizes, the prizes are assigned in accordance with the ranking list, exception. If all tie breaks are identical, the prize is split. With delete button all entered prizes are deleted. Now let's see how to correct the wrong participants data using an update player dialog box. The update player dialog box is called with menu, input, update player. This dialog box is used to correct wrongly entered data at the beginning of the tournament. In the player grid all entered players data are displayed. The data can be changed directly there. If the cursor moves into the next cell with the tab key, then the text is selected automatically. If a character is now entered, the old text is deleted. Then you must press the enter key to enter new data. The names can be searched by typing the required name in the name or code field. Here I type letter B and press enter, now all players are displayed with these first characters. The capitalization is unimportant. With blank if you hit enter all players are displayed. Now we are going to discuss print dialog box. This is a very important dialog box. Basically, each list can have outputted to screen, printer or file, depending on the corresponding parameter selected in the menu. You can select parameters by going to the menu, output and then select the parameters you want. If the output parameter is set to printer, the menu item decides whether a printing dialog is displayed or whether the list is printed immediately. If print parameters is not selected, the list is immediately printed. If print parameters is active, the following printer dialog appears after clicking a list. The printing dialog is very complicated and is divided into five sections, and those are general, text files, HTML files, columns, and others. Let's talk about each of them separately. 1. General tab. Most parameters are self-explanatory. If values were modified, these are stored permanently. The parameters size, lines per page, format and form feed saved for every standard list. The other parameters are global, valid for all lists. At the size options, exists an optimal selection that is active by default. In this case, the character size is adjusted as large as possible between 5 and 15 points so, that the list at width is still completely visible. Similar applies at lines per page, where the line spacing is adjusted. In border, here you can adjust page border size. The number of lists, here you can define how many lists you want to print. Format, here you can select page format. Portrait printing or landscape printing. The options list selection, this is used to activate one from several list variants. There is at least at the beginning a predefined which is not modifiable. Standard list which is activated by default. The remaining five or six places can be used for their own list definitions. With define new list you automatically redirect it into the section columns, here you can select which columns you want to display in the list. Here, in the predefined list, the date of births are not shown. If I want to show them in the list change this no to yes. Now you see that the date of births is shown on the list. In other settings, you can center tournament name, show or hide tournament name, arbiter's name. 
Include page number, date, and time. In the Excel file output section, you can export the current list as Excel files, and make the modification you want. By clicking default setting button, you can reset printer dialog box to its default setting. In the case of print, the list is printed correspondingly the adjusted parameters. In the case of print preview, a new window is opened and the list is shown in the preview, with perhaps small deviations. Here if the list is too wide, it is cut off at the printer. This is displayed by a vertical stroke dotted line. In this case, the character size or the left margin should be reduced or the list should be printed in the landscape format. In the print preview, the displayed page can be printed by pressing the print button, the complete list with print all button. 2. Text Files tab All lists can also be outputted as a text file with the corresponding options. 3. HTML Files tab All lists can be output to as an HTML file with the corresponding options. These files can then become published directly on the Internet. Note, the simplest, fast and professional way to publish tournament results on the Internet is, to upload the Swiss Manager file to chessresults.com Let's see that in later videos. 4. Columns tab With Define New List button in the General tab, you branch automatically into the section Columns, and the list definitions of the standard list are copied. The following changes are possible, 1, make fields visible or invisible. Press key Y for visible and key N for invisible. 2, define the direction of the fields, L for left, C for the center, R for right. 3, change the column header, maximum 15 characters, 4, change the order of the columns. The order of the columns on the list corresponds with the rows in the grid. 5, add width. Add extra column width. The unit is 1 tenth millimeters. For example, if the column width should be enlarged by 3 millimeters, a value of 30 is to be entered. 5. Other tab. With Save as Bitmap, the list can be saved as a bitmap image. Now let's see how to print several lists at once. This is a very useful option when you are doing big tournaments. For a normal Swiss system, Tournaments exist the possibility to output several different lists at the same time. The output can either at the printer or as text file or HTML file. This is possible by going to the menu, Output, Output several lists. In the left upper list box, all possible lists are displayed. If the checkbox show only the last two rounds is active, the last current two rounds are displayed. If you want to output older rounds, you deactivate the checkbox. To output or print several lists it is required to click the corresponding lists in the left list box. This list is then copied into the right list box. If you click the left list box again, the corresponding list is removed from the right list box again. The order of the rows of the right list box corresponds to the output or printing order, the list at the first row is printed first and so forth. If text or HTML files are outputted, the output occurs in the specified directory. HTML files have the extension .htm, text files the extension .text. See you in the next video about, pairing dialog box.